My name is Pat Patton. Uh, I graduated from Justice Administration in 1985. I started looking at the Justice Administration program and uh, Mount Royal had a, a really exciting looking program and there were a number of two-year programs I think at the, at the time that were more law enforcement focused. But this really had a number of different focuses that you could go into, whether it be corrections or policing or um, you know uh, various things like that. And again, that's what I liked about it. We really were shown different parts of the system and, and what we could do with it. I would have never looked into the campus security environment if I hadn't been exposed to it when I was here. Right now I'm currently the Director of Security and Operations, so I have the Campus Security Unit reporting to me as well. Most of the work that I do now is on a strategic level and it's, it's really about people. It's about working with people, uh, managing relationships, um, trying to help people do the jobs that they need to do on a day-to-day -day basis. I think on the, the physical security side, we want to try and make it um, secure but yet still open so that people can enjoy and learn uh, the area that they're working in. It is a fine balance between having a lockdown building like you'd have in a corporate building versus the, the openness that a university wants and demands. And so we really have to try and balance that. And I think that's one of the key parts of what I'm doing. Man Up Against Violence is an initiative at the University of Regina that uh, was started by a faculty member on campus. Uh, I became engaged very shortly after it started. Um, what it is is a movement to look at the socialization of men and the role of masculinity in violence. Our culture has this construct that wants to define masculinity in a certain way. From childhood to adulthood, we've been forced to compare ourselves with this construct. The first thing that comes into mind is, you know, uh, being uh, this macho uh, individual. They always thought that being a man meant being tough. It's to be that, that guy, that, that puff chest out guy. He's always talking through his teeth and he's angry and it's like, that's how you deal with your problems. I've got to the point now where I realize that uh, it's more um, standing up for others. It's more standing up for what, what is right. What we're talking about here and the message that we're trying to deliver is exactly that, is not to sit as an innocent bystander and, and to speak up, to speak up. We, we think it's a, a very important uh, movement. Um, we think that it's something that uh, uh, our students can get involved with in doing some education. And so we'd love to share it with other universities and, and other, anyone who is willing to listen. It's been very good. I uh, certainly have, uh, I have a great family. I've got great friends. Um, I love Regina. It's a great place to be. Um, and I've had great opportunities that have come from every step of my life, whether it be uh, my early education, my education here at Mount Royal, the experience I had here in Calgary, first living on my own. Um, I, it, it's all been great, so uh, I, I just keep, keep uh, thinking that things will kind of quiet down, but it doesn't, and uh, I just really enjoy where I'm at right now. <music>